If Poppy Tooker is around, she's cooking or eating or talking about food. In today's Another View segment, we are taking Poppy for a ride. We took a trip to the Carousel Gardens Amusement Park in City Park to take her back to childhood. is all about food. Poppy Tooker is a culinary activist, an author, a radio and TV host, an all around just fun <laughs> New Orleans woman. Hi, Poppy. Hi, girl. <laughs> this is going to be all the way our speed. This is my favorite thing. This is, this is going to be lovely. The carousel. your birth given name. You named yourself Poppy. Tell me the story. Well, they christened me Patricia Ann, okay. and they were trying to call me Patsy. And they would say, Patsy. And I'd say, Poppy. And they'd say, Patsy. And I'd say, Poppy. And finally, when I was about two, my grandmother said, I arrived to spend the weekend, and I announced now, it's Miss Poppy. So you went to college for theater, you're telling me. Yeah, I went that to college sense. for theater. But I have always had a huge love for everything food and New Orleans food. And that goes back to my great grandmother, who was alive till I was 10. Mm. And she taught me how you love people with food. So were you always cooking when you were younger? I was always, when I was in high school, I had a catering business. What? Medium tea, moderate, like, not spicy. This is my new baby sheep. And how many books have you written? This is number six. That's impressive. And it's my miracle book. It's beautiful. Can we just admire the art on it first? Yeah. I mean, it's like a pretty book. Well, Poppy, we've gone back to childhood, rode the rides, chatted. I'm tired. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. This was so fun. This was so much fun. I love Poppy. A portion of the proceeds from sales of Poppy's latest book, Drag Queen Brunch, goes to Crescent Care, which is a nonprofit health clinic here in New Orleans. And her book is really well done, too. It is, and the pictures are absolutely yeah. gorgeous. I will say that. I told her the book is just pretty, just like having your coffee table. Yeah, it would be something like, I mean, if you come to New Orleans, it's one of those ones tourists are going to want to pick up. And Eric, we have to go to one of those drag queen brunches together. Uh, I would I love to do that. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> That's actually on my bucket list. I that haven't been be to hilarious. one yet. That would be a lot of fun. Yeah, it would be. We